Okay, this is just a video which I'm doing uh, to show this is related to how you do a crossover with SFP cables. So th this is some uh, SFP cables that I was on a job. And basically the way that they are by default is that as you can see the the A's and the B's are, are opposite. So the way that that cable is set up is, a, is as a straight through. So if you actually try to connect two switches together with this particular cable, what will happen is you won't get a link. Because if you actually look down the cables, you, you'll actually can see the light coming out and you realize that it's going into the... It basically, the light is shining into the light and then the, the receiver is going to the receiver. So basically, with, with the way the cable, it, these you buy them like this, you won't get a link. So now here is the um, SFP socket, and as you can see, um, I'm trying to show that you can actually see the light coming through, but basically the camera can't pick it up. But obviously, when you look with your eye, you can actually see which part um, the light is coming out uh, of the um, yeah coming out of the socket. Right, see, so now I've plugged it in. So essentially, one of the sockets has a light coming out. Right, so what I'm trying to do here now is uh, I can see where the light is coming out of one of the um, the plugs. But of course, the poor old um, camera, f sorry, the camera in the phone can't see it. Because obviously, phone cameras are just nowhere near as good as your eyes when it comes to picking things up. Yeah, and so so that's the transceiver, and so basically, if there's light coming out of one of the um, ports there, right? And so what I'm showing there is basically that there isn't a link. So I've plugged both um, the cable in as it as a, it comes shipped. Right, so. So there you can see the A and B on the back of the socket, sorry, the plug. And then, you, yeah, so there, you, so there you can see the A and the B, uh, how, how they were originally. Right. So now what I've had to, what I've had to do is to take the um uh them out of the actual so you take it out of the actual holder the actual plugs right so that's it that's them out completely from the actual holder. Oh no, sorry, I've, I've, yeah, so now I've swapped the, the, okay, so that's the holder off completely, and, and there are the two, um, plugs, so now I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is to actually swap them over, okay, so I've done the swap, so now you can see, or well you should, should be able to see if you look closely. Right, so now I'm just trying to, see, so you can see the light, well, if you could see it, it'd be coming out of the different ports now because I've swapped them over inside the actual connector. Obviously, to match what's coming out of the um, the switch. And so there you have it. So now you've got the link up, and so basically, you, you can't actually buy crossovers. Essentially, if you need a crossover, you have to actually basically um, do it yourself. So obviously, some people supply crossovers, but. 
Um, that's it.